in the back. A cute little food trike might not look like a marvel of modern engineering. Instead of a typical lead acid battery pack, the designers outfitted it with a Lion 48 volt 45 AH battery. That already saves me from having to spend a few hundred bucks on lithium ion batteries from Amazon to bring my new taco truck into the 21st century. Now all I need is to slap on a couple of cheap solar panels and a roof could possibly generate several hundred watts of charging power, enough to keep my batteries fuller than the last chalupa at closing time. Despite poking a bit of fun at the design, I have to give kudos for the designers at the machine company that made this for occasionally thinking outside the box. Despite the cab being one seater, they still put two doors on it, just in case you want to mix things up every now and again. I think that technically makes it a coup too. Dang, this thing is getting cooler by the minute. So here's the thing, I'm probably not going to give up my uber glamorous job of thankless journalism for a new career path as a food truck proprietor, but I still think this is actually a pretty awesome product. In all seriousness, food service is an incredibly important industry, and it's also a real chance for many people to control their own financial future and work for themselves while doing what they love. The fact that you can get your own little food truck for 2K is pretty awesome. I could actually see people doing this. As long as you're sticking to urban use, the 25 miles per hour, 40 kilometer speed limit isn't even that bad. The thing looks funny enough that drivers should see you from a distance and give a wide berth if they need to pass. Plus, how much time will you actually need to drive it? The whole point of a food truck is that it spends 99% of its life parked. You're not tossing tamales from the open window at highway speeds, folks. Even as practical as I honestly think this food truck is, I'm not suggesting you hop into the deep end of Alibaba without doing research first. Communication is a key when shopping on Alibaba to ensure you know exactly what you're getting. But like I said at the top of this article, while many of the my silly Alibaba finds are just for fun, I think a food truck like this has a serious merit. I'd love to see more of these around in the West, serving up hot meals and warm smiles at the same time. I just hope the tacos taste the same without seasoning of the exhaust fumes. And of course, if you like to learn more about the news of the czar, you can like, subscribe, and share. And of course, click on the link on our sponsor to help support us. You guys.